manage. Is this where bodies are delivered? Yes. This is the gate to the Ibu. The place of purification. The dead are brought here by their families. Then we wash them with tears wept by the gods at the death of Osiris. Or maybe just water. Hard to say. The mummies would not be tampered with so early in the process. This man is likely innocent. What do you... Yes, yes, I know. You want to learn what I do here. I wash the bodies of the dead. It's a job. Been doing it for ten years now. There's little to say about it, really. A man of my own nature. He bears watching, though. Is your curiosity satisfied? Not yet. Be quicker. You disturb our work and the dead's rest. I would not want to make an enemy of you. I have no enemies, and no secrets either. This is just how you get rid of the brain. A useless organ. Next, I will open up the flank and take out the liver, stomach, lungs and intestines. They are the first parts of the body to rot. Fascinating. We never get visitors here. Come see us anytime. A friendly face can hide guilt. Yet, I do not suspect him. Is this salt you are working with? Uh, not salt. Natron. It dries out the body. And it fries my hands to shit. I have got burns all over. Although, they have been better lately. Has the Natron changed somehow? The texture has been a little off. Powdery. They must be getting it from a new supplier. If you want to talk, Natron, Menovbeck is the expert. If Natron is used to dry the bodies, there may be something wrong with the Natron. I should speak to the worker out back. These bodies are dried with natron? Hmm. Who might you be? A temple inspector. Right. About time you got here. Memphis has been stinking of rot for months. I suspect a problem with the natron. Where does it come from? Not far from here. Guarded by good men near the canal. Watch out for crocodiles. And lizards. Did you say lizard? It means something to you. Uh, I've heard it whispered in taverns. Rumors only. If you have nothing of substance to offer, I will be leaving. Wait. I can tell you this. Our natron is tainted. It is mixed with sand. Go to the warehouse just north of the great temple. The gods be with you. So the mummy is rotted due to the tainted natron. Let's see what is in this warehouse he mentions. Botman want. Would you accept me as a traveling companion? I will take a new title. How about Tutmose the Fearsome? I travel alone. Oh, of course. Have you heard about the palace? Crocodiles swarm its halls. Terrible. So many deaths. I am hired to slaughter the beasts, but someone is pouring blood into the water to frenzy them. And you want my help? Oh, yes, yes. 
You will shrug off a crocodile's jaws as most men would a gnat's. Kill crocodiles near the palace, and I will award you half my fee. What do you say, Magi? I am good at killing crocodiles. <laughs> I knew I could count on you. Magi the mighty, Magi the majestic, Magi the... Mm, never mind. There is a hidden cave near the city's northern limit. Meet me there tonight. What? Cave rhymes with grave. Miss that one! <laughs> Ah, Mech! The crocodile god himself would cause less chaos. They are far more aggressive than usual. There. This pile of dead crocodiles should be high enough to place Duke Mose. I'll... Crocodile. Ah, oh no. He's rubbing off on me. Here is the warehouse. I need to be careful. Only the guilty aim to disgrace the innocent. <laughs> May the gods be kind! Ah. Salt is cheap. There must be more than gold to your crime. Gold had nothing to do with it. A priest in a blue sash brought my orders. He did this to me. He threatened to do the same to my daughter. I brought foulness on this city only to protect her. I swear it! Please! Help me and I will end this. Here. I kept it. Take it. I'll send this writer to the devourer. The seal of Anubis. A priest sabotaged the Natron. The letter mentions a bandit cave. I will go clear out this viper's nest once and for all. that was listening after all. The devourer waits for your heart!
Oh. Mart will judge you in the afterlife. Hang on. And you die! The decars of those lost haunt you. Memphis is dead. We'll sleep peacefully now. Jai! Oh, I am struck dumb with fear by what I see before me! The palace grounds are choked with Sobek's dead. Did you see? In the pool, human body parts used to lure the crocodiles. Oh, what horror! But why? Oh, who knows why evildoers do evil? I came just in time to see two people loading bodies onto boats and riding away. I will put a stop to this mischief. Of course you will. And as your loyal companion, I will point you toward the mischief makers. One went toward the palace, and the other was headed for the mummification temple. Here is half my pay, as promised. I will meet you back at my boat. One day, I met an all-powerful Magi who kept the crocodiles away. Wait, oh, see She is dumping body parts into the river to attract the crocodiles.
one of the scum responsible for the crocodile attacks. Children will be more peaceful now. Een nacht, hè? Hier het een bed. Goed, als je hem gaat Why do you weep? Your curse is lifted. You have lost a child, so you should understand that a mother's fear never ends. Nor does a father's rage. Fear and rage are fair replies to life's fragility. Please, leave me to my tears. Neb, if you will follow me, we must give her privacy. Is there anything I can do to ease her? Mm. She has found the ritual protection in an ancient scroll. Only a few ingredients remain to be... I'll find them. Wait, Neb. An impatient soul is a troubled one. My lady needs parts from fresh-killed sacred birds. And would you kindly bring a fertility talisman in blue faience? There is a shop south of the Temple Basin where such items may be found. I will meet you on the road to the pyramids afterwards. May you prosper. The fertility talisman you bring us must be blue. It is very important. I will get the ritual item first, and then hunt down the birds. An 
abandoned tomb. The maid servant said there was a shop here. Strange place for a shop. A Magi? How surprising. I have not seen your kind in some time, Magi. We are a rare breed. As are merchants who set up shop in a tomb. My customers appreciate privacy. They do not seem to appreciate variety. My customers know I can provide what they seek. I hope you can do the same for me. May I have a look around? But of course. I'll leave you to browse. Excuse me, but I have some business to attend to. I'll be back soon. And in the second chamber lie the worldly goods of our Apollo and Shesh. To protect them and provide them sustenance. The message is incomplete. I wonder what the rest of it says. Seeking magical runes? Captivated for common value? Nothing of value in this room. Why would the merchant sell such cheap goods here? Ah, she is hiding something. An inventory. The talisman in blue faience is listed here. I should keep looking around. and did not want me to see this part of the shop. These goods must be stolen. A fertility talisman. Tamhotep will be pleased. Come on! Ah! You have browsed long enough, Medjai. You're scaring our customers! May the greatest of masters of May the greatest of masters of craftsmen forgive me. I was sure it was he who had brought down the curse upon Memphis. May the greatest of masters of craftsmen forgive me. Many thought this end. It is no mark against you. I was sure it was he who had brought May down the, the greatest curse upon of men, masters of craftsmen, masters of craftsmen, for I was no sure it was he who had okay. brought down the curse upon Memphis. The maid servant said they wanted stung. That is all the items. Now to meet Tamhotep on the road to the pyramids. Oh, 
And now the Herald of Ta is laid to rest. The new bull looked well. What do you think was wrong with him before? Oh, I couldn't say. I heard that he was poisoned. But hey, bull! Simba Ow. Help for what? Me, Sanabes! I found what you need, Tamhotep. The seer spoke truth when he named you Deliverer. My ritual must be performed in the moon shadow at the base of the pyramid of Josa. Will you guard me and my maid until it is done? There may be dangers on the road as well. Gladly. Then let us ride to the pyramid and wait until the night unfurls in splendor. This is uncertain country. Why not bring more guards? My ritual must remain private. Is that also why we travel off the main road? Yes, it is less safe but more secret. The lack of a son lowers my husband in the esteem of the people. And if they knew of the babes I have lost, his ability to compel the gods would be called into question. There are whispers against him already. My troubles bring shame to him and to me. Nebet, it is not your fault. Hush, Mara. I know you mean to be kind, but the scrolls are clear. The woman is the carrier of the child's sex. I do not believe that, Nebet. Oh, Mara. We have had this conversation before. Let us be quiet now, in case our voices carry to unfriendly ears. Good idea. Here. My sword stands between your ritual and any who threaten it. The Taz blessing on you.
Every morning of my childhood, my father and I spoke the prayer of the Medjai, a promise to those in need. I am a Medjai. I am a feather in the eagle's wing, a living dagger plunged from the sky into the heart of chaos. I am a truth unknown, a scabbard unfilled, a son of the Nile, and a defender of the people. You cannot kill me, for I walk among the dead. Come forth by day, and I will guide you home. My son should have learned this prayer from me. Thank you. 